definitely a more energy in the stadium when it's York versus Lancaster. And Started way back in, in the early, uh, late 40s. Uh, that's when we had George Hill, the Woody Wheatman, uh, Kaya, our Ripplin. We had a lot of older players went on to the major leagues, and as the Water Roses have done a lot for the two cities. I remember back to the first meeting in, in 2007, the excitement that there was for that, and we had so many different kind of points along the way to be really excited about, you know, like the first game and the first War of the Roses game and the first home game. But York versus Lancaster was huge and I remember how packed the stadium was and all the, the throng of, of media that was there for it and everything and um, you know it's it's you're never going to replicate that first meeting but yes it, it's doing real well, well but one thing I, I do wish that uh, they would do uh, in the scheduling is, as far as affecting the two teams is the scheduling the, the uh, home teams home at the same time and away at the same time and it's uh, making uh, smaller attendance I do believe I, I think if they would uh, you know, set the home and away, uh, it would make better uh, attendance, uh, which was what, what the main thing is, attendance is, is what is baseball or basketball. Is. As the season goes on, I think a lot of the players, especially ones that have been here from one year to another, they'll kind of catch on to it, and it'll mean something to them too, especially if it's like a, a battle for the community cup that comes down to the end, uh, like it did in 2008. I mean, that team, they were almost as excited to clinch the cup three days after clinching the division as they were to clinch the division. Yeah, I was on a group that uh, originally uh, tried to get Lancaster back into it. I was on the redevelopment authority and that's one of the ones that voted upon getting it back to the Lancaster. I mean the, the fans are the ones that are here year in and year out. The players come, the players go. Um, so I think they definitely feed off the energy from the crowd and they know how much each city cares about it, but I think more than anything it is for the fans. Hey! Hey!